Okay, so this is another video talking about the wingman and the pointman strategy on covering 90 degree corners. For example, this one here. Let me close the door and I'll explain. As you possibly already know, the pointman is going to be the man pointing, duh. It's going to be the man in the front guiding where the two are going. And the wingman is going to be the guy behind checking every corner, making sure that nobody stays behind or no one is setting any traps whatsoever, trying to flank you, whatever. This 90 degree corner has a little bit of a tricky rule. In this corner here there is a door and there might be someone hiding right here or the door might be open, just say this one door here is open. Before reaching this line over here, this line right there, the two must slow down, the point man will slow down, he will put his gun in this position, not let being seen from whoever is inside, whoever in this corner right here will not see the gun when he reaches this position. If they see your gun before they can see you, they will have a better reaction time. So every time you reach, let's just say 45 degrees this angle here, you put your gun down. The point man will get cover and quickly not engage but get information. Get information on what's in here and if there's any traps or if there's any enemies in a corner far or nearby. The wingman shall stay behind, not too close to allow the point man to come back if he has to. If, let's just say, the point man falls down right here, he got downed, he cannot move, he cannot do anything else. It's going to be the wingman's responsibility to cover fire so that he can resurrect his point man. If you do not see where is the enemy, if you have this angle right here and you try to shoot, it's going to be up to your point man to say, Aim a little bit more to the left, aim a little bit more to the right. With teamwork and proper communication, you're going to be able to know exactly where to shoot so you can pin down the enemy and resurrect your point, man.